Hello, welcome to Graveyard Keeper. This is the alpha version ahead of its release on August the 15th, 2018 for PC, Xbox, Switch and PS4. And this game has been developed by Lazy Bear Games. Uh, and thanks to the uh, good people at Tiny Build for sending me a key to this. They, they, they're the publishers. Alright, so let's get going with this. This is a kind of um, RPG, Stardew Valley, Machiavellian style game. It'll all become clear shortly. It's an ordinary day, and our hero is hurrying home, where someone very important is waiting for him. Every, even in everyday routine, there's a place for loving and feeling loved. Uh, don't worry, this introduction is quite short. But, um, especially when you know that someone misses you. Hello. Oops. He's having a smashing time. What's happened? Where is everything? Calm down, you're me you've merely turned a page in your life. A whole new chapter awaits you ahead. But I need to go home. Can I go home? No. Well, apparently, there is always a way to get home. Hmm, let me see. You, your new home is a graveyard. Does that mean I'm dead? It means you're a graveyard keeper now. Conveniently. But I need to go home to my love. Then you need to be a good graveyard keeper. You should dig up Jerry. He'll help you sort everything out. Who? What a strange vision. What is this nightmare? All right, let's go find Jerry. Right, so here we go. Actual gameplay. Hooray! Right, so we're starting our little hut, and we go down here. I've only played this for like two minutes, and that's it so far. Um, all I've done so far is this introductory type bit. Already the, the art is absolutely lovely. <sighs> Look at it. Anyway, <laughs> we have to follow the yellow arrow at the moment. All these things you can actually interact with by the looks of this. A place for wooden logs. Oh! Um, yeah, <laughs> wasn't expecting that. Um, okay, that's for crafting. That's for later. In the meantime, it looks like we do actually have to be, um, dig up mate. Hello, mate. Get up, lazy bones. Oh, hello. <laughs> Holy sod, I'm a skull. Are you Jerry? Hmm, <laughs> why would you think I'm Jerry? A man with a red eye told me that I need to dig up Jerry. <laughs> a red eye, I remember. <laughs> oh, sod, that's right, I'm Jerry. How did you find me? The man told me that he'd answer all my questions. Good, good. But first, let me ask you, who are you and where the sard are we? Is that like a swear word? I think it is. Swearing skull. I must be dreaming. None of this can be real. Mm, you're the graveyard keeper. What else do I remember? Let me think. I remember that sound. Let's go check it out. Everything is so strange. None of this makes any sense at all. Boing. 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 <laughs> Something is very wrong with that animal. Hmm, he could be dangerous. You know, I think it'd be better if I wait for you here. I might scare the poor thing. Yeah. Oh, hello. Let's put the cart before the horse. Donkey. Oh, it's alright. Hmm. <laughs> Got a fresh cups from town. Wow, a speaking donkey. You, you can understand me. Let's talk. Who are you? I'm cheap labour. This cart isn't mine, so I have to work for a capitalist bastard who owns it. Yay. And I only earn five carrots a day. This, uh, bloody millennial donkeys. This situation deeply humiliating. You know where I'm coming from, right, comrade? This bastard pretends that he doesn't understand anything I'm saying. Anyway, I need to go back to town. You get rid of this one and I'll bring you a new one. What a strange land this is. Mate. But look, we've got ourselves a, uh, a fresh corpse. I've got a stiffy! No, hang on, that's not right. Hey, what are you staring at? Grab that juicy corpse while it's still fresh. Uh, I feel we should take it to the morgue. I don't remember why. But I'm pretty sure it'll be fun and might be profitable. Oh, I'm going to puke. Let's do it! Oh, there we go. Oh, there's a graveyard. Let's keep it. Actually, let's go. Let's just toss this into the, um, the, what looks like the sewers. Sard, I like this place. Feels like home. The sewers. Put the body on the autopsy table. Then, mm, what's next? Slice some fresh flesh from the corpse. Uh, that should be good for starters. What? No way. When I said Machiavellian, it's nothing like Machiavellian. This isn't right. Sure, sure, it's not right. How can I forget? Maybe it's because I'm a talking skull with an amnesia. It isn't right that you don't know where you are. It isn't right that I'm a skull. Nothing is right here. So shut the, f the sard up and do as I tell you. What a pissy skull. You promised to tell you'll tell me how to get home. You just need to drain this mead in a village tavern for booze. Talking skulls never lie. And then bring the beer to me. 
Oh good, we've got a drunken skull. First slice. You've unlocked new technology and got blueprint, flesh, and palette. Blueprint. Yeah. So do I have to do that then? Ah. Alright. And yes, hold F. To pay my respects to the body. That's disgusting. I said. You get used to it! So what did I do with the corpse? I don't know, let's bury it. Take this corpse, I'll wait you in the graveyard. Hmm. Oh yeah, right, take out. Is that 94%? Um, hmm. I hope we're going to do this lad proud. Uh, nothing wrong, I'm just having a bit of a look around. Did you say, what did you say to take it? Was that you dump it? Flush it down the bog or something? Oh, let's follow the yellow arrow. Ah! Here we go. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, he's here! How did he get here? Okay. Need a shovel. He's got a shovel, he's a talking skull. Let's bury it! Use the blueprint desk of the graveyard. M mark the site for the grave and then dig it with your shovel. Carefully put the body or what remains of it in the grave. Bury! Desecrate! Do not desecrate! Decorate! Warning! Do not use goat skulls and upside down stars for decoration. Alright. So use the blueprint desk at the graveyard. Uh, make a sir. <laughs> oh, I've actually got the shovel. That looks like the blueprint desk at the graveyard. Ooh! Now I see. So, let's put it... Well, it would be rude not to put it there. Right. Get the shovel out. And slowly but surely, a hole emerges. Where did he put all the soil? Ah! <laughs> Grab. The old grab and toss. Inter? There. I've interred the hell out of that. Now presumably I have to press F to give it a good old tonk. Nicely done. Hmm, this burial certificate. I remember. Money. Alcohol. Alcohol. Hmm, I sure used to like it a lot. Uh, this is just me talking now. I'm not reading. Oh, sorry. Here comes Bishop. Here's your boss. Let's go and bash him. Oh, bloody hell, it is the Bishop. The Bishop! Oh, oh, I know. Ask him about this burial certificate. He should know. Summit. I better leave now. I'll be in the morgue waiting for my booze. Booze, the old skull. There he goes. Uh, oh, God, a new voice. Oh, oh, I'm so... T oh, that's a terrible voice. Uh, oh, oh, I'm so tired. Why? Oh, he's got... Let's stop talking. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, look. What's this sign over here? The air this area closed due to the ancient curse? Flip it, heck. Cor blimey governor. What a load of rotten cursory. Oh, hello. He's, a, he's got big hands. He had he did an arms thing. Oh, Keeper, there you are. That's his voice now. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but your graveyard is a bloody pigsty. Sorry, ah, uh, you slag. There's no way I'm promoting you to cleric until you fix it. I didn't realise I wanted to be a cleric. All right, current location name, location. Mm. Important location information, the graveyard quality, the church appeal, etc. Repair graves to increase the graveyard's overall quality. You'll probably need special resources to do that. You've unlocked a new technology and got a wooden gravestone. Soon your graveyard quality is at least five skulls. I'll be listen, I'll be pleased to prom Oh, where the hell his voice was. You look like a spiritual leader, and I'm a good of I'm a good judge of character. Ha ha. I'm good at everything. That's why I was chosen to represent his will. Ha ha. Your predecessor used to keep his stuff in a trunk somewhere here. You should nick it. I'll come by again next week. In fact, I come here every. Sun icon? Maybe I'm not dreaming. Did I eat some it? Oh, he's waiting. What should I say? Why is it you come here? It's part of my duty, the unpleasant part. It's kind of like an old tradition in that. I don't know much about all the traditions and rituals. I'm just here to represent his mighty and glory. Ha ha. He's a sarcastic prick. He's Mel Lewis all over again. I have one tiny question. What is this burial certificate? As soon as the body has been laid to rest, you can trade its burial certificate for money at the village tavern. Ah. How can I fix the graveyard? Yeah, let's do that. If I fix the graveyard, I've not done that. 
It just repair all the graves. It shouldn't take me an, even an hour, but it's your job. What a lazy bishop. I think we've already... Yeah. Okay. We've already done that. Actually, this, this... This. I need to go home. There's a talking skull. He forced me to butcher a corpse. Ha ha, a fine joke. I'm a humorist myself. Here's one. Who is BB? Who? I am. Ha ha. Oh, he, he giggled. Blessed and beautiful. I'm going to laugh at him. Not with him. It's important. Oh, <laughs> all right. If you want to repair kids while fixing the graveyard, you can always craft a new one. Oh, God. There's a lot of information. So red points represent your handcrafted skills and your ability to work with materials. Green points represent your knowledge about the nature of things, generally. Uh, blue points represent your spiritual knowledge of the immortal world. You earn points simply by doing anything. Also, you can get new points by stu st studying new items at a, sp at a special table. Uh, blueprints. Oh, God. You can collect sticks and you can chop trees. Oh, no. This is not the sort of thing I really want to see <laughs> on a blind let's play. Alright, so now I've got myself a little bunch of stuff there. My trunk is somewhere around here, apparently, but maybe I can get it directly from in here. Oh, have I got a hot bar? I wonder if I can... No, well, we'll leave that for now. Ah, oh, there's the trunk. Right, yes, that's more like it. So, oh, oh, uh, just one. One will do. You, you. Actually, I don't think I actually did anything there, did I? Okay, just, okay. Sorry, we'll get it all. Right. So I'm still uncertain how to actually get that into there. Apparently he's equipped. Ah, oh, okay. So can I chop this tree down? Well, I'm going to follow the yellow arrows anyway. Because that seems to be what I have to do. Look, but the bishop, he's got some chicken under his hat. I think he, I think he's just, I think he's a magic bishop. He's got a chicken hat or something. But no, I'm just going to follow the yellow thing. I'm sure there's something at the end of this path. Eventually. <laughs> this is actually quite a long road. The road goes ever on. Oh, hello, there's a mate. We take a little diversion. Uh, apparently the path is closed until that symbol there. So I'm looking at the clock in the top left. We have... I'm trying to work out the symbols. Uh, there's a lot of green devil at the top, followed by a, a, div uh, a divining stick, and then a woman, and then the sun, the moon, and a man. Time is weird here in the graveyard world. It does look like we're having a bit of a day-night cycle thing going on here. Now we're going to run for, through fields of wheat. Yeah, let's, let's have a bit of running. I'm naked! Whee! I'm so naughty. I'm not. I'm a graveyard keeper. There are no jokes in the afterlife. Just people screaming bloody hell. Hello. Oh, it's the dead horse! Yes, found the boozer! Down the pub we go. What are these people? Who are you people? I'm not in a good mood. F uh, go away. Oh, well, there's a, 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 the monk is here. Hello, monk. Are you monking off? What are you? Arr, bad luck. Not today. No, bloody table. Let's have a word with barkeep. Look at the way he's combed his thinning hair over his head. Like Gregor Fisher. Welcome to the Dead Horse Tavern. I am Heradric. Oh, bad luck, mate. How can I help you? Uh, hang on, I'm about to click. <laughs> I came from the graveyard. I woke up here today and things have been crazy since then. Oh, dear. I don't care. I'm bald. Oh, I'm sorry. I could not... Whatever it said. <laughs> so he's, up, he's happy anyway. Things are looking bright for us. Small village. Where are you planning to open the church? I need to fix the graveyard first. Sure, sure, it's been a while since anyone took care of it. So let's go down to business. Uh, how can I help you? Well, I think booze. But I think this is the most important thing. I'd like to trade you some fresh meat. That actually is the booze thing, isn't it? Uh, meat is delicacy in our village. I'd be glad to buy it. I just need to see the royal meat stamp on it. Yeah. Do you to think what the royal meat is? 
Uh, many years ago, there was an accident with an inappropriate meat. Ever since then, all meat must be approved by royal authority. <laughs> and I don't need any trouble with the, the town. Um, does your meat have a stamp? No. I don't even know on any network. Oof. But wow, it looks really good. But without a stamp, my hands are tied. Where can I get this stamp? Oh, you can send a form to the royal court through a mailbox near your church. But it'll cost you a bundle. But there's another way. I'll tell you just because of my neighbours. Come closer. There's this guy called Snake. I think he has a fake royal stamp. But to be honest, I haven't seen him for a while. I think he's off talking to the penguins in the outpost. You can ask Miss, Ch Miss Charm. She comes here every woman. Um, I bet she can help you to find the snake. This is a very strange game. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, ooh, what can I trade? It looks really furtive. Okay. Oh, Keeper, could you kindly take this letter to our local blacksmith? Sure, where can I find him? The southeastern corner of the village. Ooh, letter to the blacksmith. These items are locked until the vendor gets to tier two. But I could also... How much cash have I got? I've got any cash. I've got... No quid. Probably can't really buy anything for that. So... We can go to a blacksmith, and there's some, there was something about a. Um, actually, wasn't really paying attention. No NPCs. Oh, here we go. I know the donkey. I know the cap. Well, I don't actually know the captain. I think it was just the, oh, he's the pirate, wasn't he? Uh, but anyway, so so you need to get home to your love. That's fine. Uh, reach five skulls of the graveyard with the bishop. That's fine. Get a beer from the tavern. Do I, did I actually get that? Or do I actually have to? Oh no, I have to do the. Um, here it is. Find a stamp and sell meat to Heradric. Uh, bring the letter to Hold and return. Right, so that seems to be why I have to... Okay. That seems to be the thing to do now. Oh, it's pissing down. Ah! <laughs> Mate. I don't know any way of setting an active quest. I don't think there is. Uh, this screen I don't understand at all. Oh, it's not even available in the alpha version, apparently. Some of that stuff. Uh, apparently the alpha version is... Um, oh, I can, I can start chopping down. There's a lot in the alpha version, apparently. It's not complete, but there's a... There's definitely a lot in it, apparently. It's like not just like um, like a quarter done or anything. I mean, if it's going to be coming out on like August, what am I even doing? I'm just getting totally stuck here. Then I'd expect it to be fairly complete. I do some unwarranted chopping and gathering. Oh, I've got some experience. I've got some red experience, which, if we remember, was red. <laughs> I can't remember. I can remember green was like doing natural things. And the blue things were... No, actually, I really can't remember anything. Oh, well. Let's move onwards. Let's try and find the black... Oh, dear. This doesn't look, really look like... Is it still a village? I feel like I'm going down the... Many tiers of... That looks like the... Yeah, that's the ed edge of the village, isn't it? The path to the town is closed. Troublesome. You need a town pass. All right. Um, blacksmith. That looks... Does that look blacksmithy? No, but there's a bog. There's a nice little bog to the top left. Uh, this looks like... This is like looks like a farmer of some description. Let's wander through his beetroot. That looks like a blacksmith's. Yes! Silly little prick. See, he's got his mouth closed in this game. Hey, what are you staring at? Nothing, just looking around. I think I'm the keeper of the local graveyard. May I ask you who you are? Are you? Unfortunately... Oh, yes. I'm <laughs> getting mixed up who's talking. Unfortunately, I'm the local blacksmith. Name's Kresvold. Give him the letter. I have a letter. A letter, of course, one minute away, and he can't be bothered to come himself. Ha! I guess old habits never die. Unlike you. <laughs> I mean, thank you. Sorry for my nagging. It seems it's my new habit. Hmm, slimes again. Heradic has been told me to get rid of them. I don't have the time for these pesky little green bastards, but maybe you can... I'm not doing a slime quest, am I? God damn it. Uh, take this rusty sword and an energy pot. The sword is broken, but you can repair it with the, on the whetstone. You can keep the whetstone. Maybe you'll need it to repair your shovel sometime. If you manage to kill them, bring me their remains, and I'll spare you some materials. They should be right up the other side of my house, near the puddles. Ah, energy, eh? You can always refill your health and energy with food and potions. Press tab. Sleeping will also restore your... Yeah. Okay. Uh, thanks, Stardew Valley. 
Defeated the slimes. I have not defeated the slimes. Ask him where to find metal ore. You know what? I like to work with metal myself. And where can I find some ore? You can find metal ore in the swamp soil. Brick. Here's what he said. Ah, <laughs> oh, bridge. It said bridge collapsed. You've unlocked a new technology and unlocked... Or whatever. A furnace. Gathering swamp iron. Ore can be gathered from small deposits of body soil. Recipe, iron, and that. Right, let's have a go with this. Um, sword. Redstone, sword. And work. Work that booty. There we go. A rusty sword. And a whetstone. Nice. Let's go to the bog. Bog. Cannot be got. Well, that looks like the swamp to the east, anyway. Maybe that's where the slimes are, but it's going to be a pain to get around to getting there. Can I even do that? No, I don't think I can. Maybe there are other puddles. Let's go north. Actually, let's see what this is. Oh, just, oh, it's a stick. Just a stick. Ah, slimes. There we go. Um, let's quickly... That's not, that's not inventory, is it? Actually, where, this, where the hell's it? There it is. <laughs> uh -huh. Is it a case of... Is it, is it context? Apparently, you, pre you press space. I might have just missed that instruction at some point. But... Tonk. Tonk. Oops. <laughs> not enough energy. Oh, is that it? Is that all my energy? I'm spent. It means I have to rest or use my potions. Yeah, that give me some. Got some green jelly. I don't know how much I need. I think I needed two, don't I? For this to actually work. That's probably why I got two potions, I guess. I'm actually hurting quite bad. Uh, oh, missed. There we go. Is that enough? Defeat yep. Yeah, defeated the slimes. Task complete. Simple iron parts. Good job. Take this whetstone. Just sharpen the broken tools to be as good as new. I think I've already done that, haven't I? Uh, well, apparently whatever it is is locked. God, I've got a lot of stuff. Obviously, I don't need any of this crap at the moment, so I'm not going to bother with that. I might be able to sell stuff to him. I wonder what his house is like. Oh. Apparently, I've got to be a bit more friendly with him. I've got to butter him up. Possibly literally. Right, so what's the other quest I have to do? Um, bring the letter to Kresvold the blacksmith and return. So I've got to go back to the pub. Um, let's see if I can remember where the pub is. Is that the pub? That looks very well lit. I think it is. Hello, mate. Oh! Um, that... What's she saying? You want to be loved by me! Boop boop be doop! Oh. I don't know if I've actually got any health to actually um any way of restoring my health, I don't think I have. Ah. It's good you know how to use a sword. Kreswold told me how you helped him. Somehow. Here, have a beer, it's on the house. Alright. Ask him about the burial certificate. I think we've probably already done that. Oh no, maybe not. The bishop told me you would buy my burial certificates. Yes, he's right. As a head of a village, according to the ancient contract, I have to trade it for money. Oh, if if only only if I have any money. What do you mean? The village is going through hard times. We're short on cash. But as soon as you open the church, pilgrims will bring lots of shiny coins to the village. Ah. Fair enough. Let's have a look at this, then. Still got to find a stamp and sell meat. So do we have any, um, any leads on that? Hmm. I need to go. Just give me a. I've got a beer, I think. So theoretically, if I go back to mate, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna go say hello to my skull, which I think is quite a long way away. Oh, hello! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Where you been? I was at the village. This place is so weird, but it feels so real. And everyone is okay with me just appearing out of nowhere. Todd, you're stealing my thoughts. Stealing? I remember there's a cellar in your cottage. Some provisions must be stored there. You've unlocked a new technology. I'm gathering edible mushrooms. Can be cooked at home. 
apple, can be gathered from a wild apple tree, and also bushes. Sweet and sour berries. Mm. Wheat! Exactly! I remember baking bread out of it! And pies! Sweet berry pies! Toast! Onion toast! Oh, that's good with beer! Sard, you know what? I need a beer! This is beginning to feel like a one-sided relationship. Bring me beer and I'll tell you a lot of important stuff. Like how you can get home, wink wink. Questions? Ask about the small road. That sounds rock and roll, let's do that. <laughs> it was rhetorical! Do I look like a magic head with answers? <laughs> well, technically, yes. Sard, you smart ass. Um, I'll be waiting for that beer at my place. No beer, no answers. Oh, you little twat! I was going to give you the beer! Oh, I want to find his place now. I, I can't actually remember where he is. I think it was that crypty thing, wasn't it? it was, was it over here? Probably. Um, I've just optimistically pressed M in an attempt to actually um, <laughs> see if there's a map. But it looks like we're actually coming towards the daytime now. It wasn't down bottom left, was it? So this is how much I pay attention in a game. <laughs> uh, or is it down below? Oh, what's this? Fireflies. We definitely haven't been here before. It'd be nice to have a bit of an explore. Oh, that's waterfall. Oh, we can do fishing there. Also... Also, what have I, what have I found? Oh! God damn it. Hang on. Right. Yes. Some river sand. Oh, alright. <laughs> Got some river sand. Feel like I just um, kind of wasted a potion doing that. Right, so that's that's where um, thingy is. I think presumably. Oh, I can just no. <laughs> it could do with a back entrance. This. Oh, it's in the God, it's in here, isn't it? Right. Have you a beer? Fuck. Give him a beer. Ah, what a disappointment. I think I needed something stronger. All right, you seem like a decent guy. Here's some advice. Stop running around bragging that you're from another world. I don't remember it clearly, but it was for doing something similar that I lost my body. So if you want to keep yours, stop! Maybe he's right. I should be more careful. So what was your question? Do I have some questions? He wants wine as well. Always mixing his drinks. Mind you, he doesn't give a shit. He's a skull. How do we get home? Easy. I'm sure you could use the portal on which hill? So I, ju I just need to go through it or what? Do I need to turn it on? I obviously don't have a brain inside here, so I'm not sure where this knowledge is coming from. I've told you everything I can remember. Maybe some books from the library could help. Wow, the church has a library in its cellar. Or maybe the young astrologer knows he's a smart boy. Uh, huh. uh, through the church. Oh, oh, there's a network of tunnels down here. Ah, yeah. oh, they're, they're talking about fish. Fish. <laughs> All right, so he wants wine next. But let's ask, quickly ask about this. Uh, his wine was the best, and he was a big friend of the lighthouse keeper. They used to hang out at the lighthouse every moon thing. Better ask where that is. Um, oh, he doesn't know. Unless he has wine. Oh, see, we can see how this relationship is going. I don't think I can get anywhere. Oh, hello, what's this? Repair the desk requires more stuff. What about you over here? Nothing, can't do anything there. Carve out. So, no, I need a lot of stuff to do that. So, what exactly do I do next? Let's have a look. Well, mate, you boy wants a boozy bottle of wine. I think maybe I should try and do something at the graveyard, since it is my graveyard. Let's actually find our way in. And see if I can actually do anything to make this place look a little presentable. This is minus... Oh, hello! I'm not going to assume it, am I? Fix. Alright. This might tidy things up a bit. Ooh! It's now a um, zero-sum game grave. Fix. Oh, I can... I can do that as well, okay. Already I'm making it look presentable. Well, that's, that's a very nice grave. Old graveyard, quality minus 25. Well, let's see. Let's see if we can get up, up a bit more. 
not quite sure why I'm uh, the this, like examine is E, but then work is F. Like, almost feels like it should be a context sensitive thing. That it's just the same button, maybe. Oh, I can't do that one. Unfortunately, it's a, maybe a bit too much. Well, let's. This one's really buggered. Fix gravestone. Okay. I think that this is the repair tool stuff, which I'll need to have to craft some more. I think, from what I remember it said earlier. Uh, stone grave fence. Oh, we can do that as well. Okay. So, so far, the, um, I managed to get the old graveyard quality up to minus 20. Minus, eight, minus 18. Not bad. Not bad. I don't think I can do any more, can I? Oh, yeah. I can do, I can do one more. I can do one more little job. Oh, I never run out of energy, so that's that sketch knackered then. Yeah, starting to look a little more presentable. I wonder if, I can actually, I wonder if these trees are any needed technology. Oh. What was that? There's school out. Huh. Anyway. <laughs> I think actually, have I got more provisions in the trunk? No, I think I took everything out, didn't I? Yeah, that's right. What about you? You look like something I can do. Oh, I still haven't got enough energy. I might actually need to have a sleep. I can't get in the church. Hmm. I could just go and have a kip. Oh! Oh, a new bod has turned up. Oh, I see. God, there's going to be a new one every day. It's that bloody donkey, isn't it? His, his problem. He's the thing. Now, I haven't actually got anywhere to bung this, have I? Um, so I will need to... Now, where was it? Gravesite, there it is. Not you there. And... Flip it, heck! Oh! Well, I could try gathering some... I think you said, the... said you could gather some... Apples from trees and mushrooms and something. I'm not quite sure if that will restore my stamina or not. What's that? What's the thing? My body's not going to. My body's going to rot by the time I've had to sleep. Um, God damn it! There's everything. Everything's everywhere. Everything's just sh sh shabby at this place. Um, anyway, I'm going to try and get me some sleep. Where's, is that the bed? That's the bed, isn't it? Sleep. Oh, look, this is doing quite a lot. Right, that's enough. I'm so refreshed. I only got half my stamina back because I couldn't be bothered to wait any longer. But let's... Well, part of the reason was I don't, I don't want that body to rot before I actually get a chance to bung in the old... Oh, what's... Yeah. Oh, that's because I started working on it and didn't do anything with it. It's still only at 92% rotting. So I think we're, we're probably good to go. Just want to get rid of this bugger. And pick it up. Get in the old. And do the old Tonkaroo. There we go. Burial certificate, which I presumably then go and take back to Matey Boy. Maybe we'll give him some wine. Um, let's find out. Um, trade. What's this? Right, so I've given him two to him. So I've got three silver, I think. Um, well, those are beers. They're not actually wines, which is a bit worrying. Oh, he said something about a wine cellar, didn't he? Oh, bloody hell. I think he did anyway. Again, wasn't paying nearly enough attention. <laughs> Well, okay, let's um, let's wrap this up a bit because I think we um, we've, seen, we've been going for quite a while, and this is just one. I just want this to be a little taste of the um, the, the alpha. So, say this is available now if you if you pre-order it. If you pre-order the game from the website, you do. If you pay, a, I think if you if you, if you pre-order it for a certain price, you get the game when it eventually comes out in August. But if you pay a little bit more, you'll get instant access to this alpha. Who are you? Ding dong, bing bang bong, dig I am. Am I? This Linus. Uh, <laughs> I think he smells. Okay, so as I said earlier, this is out for PC, Xbox, Switch, and PS4, August the 15th, uh, which is not too long away. You can pre-order it now and get access to the pre-alpha, or whatever the hell this is, <laughs> right now. Uh, okay, so thanks for watching. Do subscribe to notify when new stuff goes live about all the latest and best new indie games, all the upcoming stuff, and there's the donkey. Hello. Uh, I was gone. <laughs> 
Uh, well, see you next time. Bye for now. Oh, it's raining.